What up gamers, Fence here here, and welcome back to Borderlands 3. So last episode we helped it out Ava with her um, whole thing with her diary and all that. <laughs> you know, return some stuff to, back to her because, yeah, she left some stuff back here before she went to Sanctuary. But yeah, we also got this other quest over here for uh, Brother Mandel. We kind of heard his voice uh, kind of in the end of the last episode, but hey, accept. You must come quickly. The holy distillery is infested with rats. This way. Okay. Thank the six storms. My prayers are answered. I am Brother Mendel of the impending storm, sworn to an oath of non-violence. So I must beg your assistance with these ferocious rats. You <laughs> must eradicate them for me. There okay. we are. Now, inside, quickly, before the rats completely infest this holy place. Okay, so yeah, this guy took an oath to not be violent, but he wants me to be violent instead. So yeah, I mean, it make, it works out, right? You know, he can still do his thing. Ah, that's rat gunk. Our distilled spirit should be strong enough to melt such things. Shoot the nearby cask and be rid of that foul infestation. Okay. I would handle this myself if it weren't for my oath. Believe it or not, <laughs> I am forbidden from even slapping a mosquito that bites me. Wow. Woe is me for choosing the non-violent path. <laughs> so, you must slaughter in my stead, oh, okay. gunslinger. Alright, I mean, I'll try. Let's see what I can do. Let's go take care of this, uh, broad mother. How I envy you, Vault Hunter. Unencumbered by the oath, unchained by morality, hunt down those foul wretches and rip the still beating hearts from their wretched thoraxes. <laughs> oh man, this guy. He really regrets not fighting. It appears that this monster has died of over intoxication. Ah, do me an additional favor and retrieve its liver. Okay. Uh. Gonna go in. Take care of this broad mother too. Disembowel them, my divine murderer. Splay their guts on the ground like intestinal confetti. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> Will do. Ooh, the inventory's full. And yeah, got this <laughs> other legendary here. I did look it up to see if other people also get legendaries very easily, and that seems to be the case. I've also gotten some, you know, a lot of legendaries, so, so did other people. Ooh, here we go. Yeah, it just seems really fast just to do the auto bear. Here we go. Nice. Oh boy. Screaming into the void. Split its skull and drench this holy place in monstrous blood. Where, where? The suffering is intoxicating. Okay, this guy, man. This guy is... He's really into it. <laughs> I feel like he might turn. Also, I'm not really sure... How do you do that optional quest? Harvest the intoxicated ratch livers. I am not sure where to find that. Oof. Sort of uh, got caught up in the moment. Thank the six storms you came along when you did. When the Malawan scourge is driven away, we will toast your divine bloodshed. Grab that clapper and ring the bell of inebriation to summon me when you are ready. A reward is in order. Um, okay. There's that. Can ring the bell, but uh, oh, here's the bell. When we monks take the oath of non violence, we must relinquish all our worldly weapons, they are stored nearby. And I urge you to take whatever you need from our weapon <clears throat> depository, my vivisecting avenger. Then return to me. Yeah, okay, but how do we find these livers? <laughs> it's 
not these, right? Oh, Arvis liver. That rat's liver seems uh. perfectly pickled for our purposes. Okay, I got it now. So there's these bodies. These corpses around. And I just gotta find them. But I am not sure. Oh, here we go. Ah, now that should come in handy once the infestation is cleared out. Alright. Oh, another one. Excellent. That pickled ratch liver will be very useful to me. Okay, two more left. Yep, I pretty much got it now. <laughs> I was kind of confused with the with the livers. I thought it would be a, like a drop, but uh, yeah, it wasn't. I shall make such a spirit with that rat liver. Wait, wait. <laughs> okay. Oh, we got a chest. Uh, two things I don't feel like getting right now. All right. There's just one more left. It could be in the other room. Uh, you think it's in here somewhere? Oh, I see it. Nice. Uh, place the intoxicated thing over there. Wait, do I go to go all the way back? I, I'm kind of afraid to repair the bell right now. Because I think that will, um... I think that will just end things. Wait, let me look at the map first. So, we do have this thing over here. <laughs> I'm kind of scared. I don't remember the map too much. Is that way also blocked? Well, I guess we'll find out. Okay, go back up here. And you repair the bell. Oh yeah, it is blocked. So I need to repair the bell first before I can actually get through. Oh my gosh. Alright. I did not know they can... <laughs> they can do that. That was kind of like a jump scare, but... I wasn't really scared though. I was more like startled. Like I didn't know they can really do that. Oh well, yeah, that's really interesting. Yeah, these wretch, these ratch guys. Yeah, these guys are definitely next level to a skag. And yeah, we probably not gonna be seeing a lot of skags anymore, right? Because we're on other planets. There we go. Ring. There we go. Nice. And so I believe we've done it. No, COV. I already got my legendaries. I feel like that's all I can really... That's all, all I really want to use right now. I admit I am conflicted by my part in your unhinged pursuit of violence. Yet, perhaps <laughs> such transgressions are themselves the will of the storms. You have given me much to ponder, Vault Hunter. And much to drink. Salut. Truly, this is the happiest of ours. Ah... And I see you've gathered the pickled ratch livers I asked for. Très bien, très bien. An additional reward is in order. Oh boy, additional see, reward. These pickled ratch livers are actually the secret ingredients behind our holy spirits. We keep a flock of ratch for this purpose. But oh. they escaped their bonds and started running. Yeah, hold on. I just uh, leveled up. Okay. Um, this is what I wanted, right? Yeah, the cooldown time to be decreased. There we go. Wild throughout the distillery. Oh, hold on. We also got a new shield. Is it this? Mendel's multi multivitamin shield. <laughs> um, I mean, why not? There we go. So yeah, that was it. I guess that was it. All right. So yeah, what is next? Pretty much, we got some other. A lot of these other quests. I guess Ava's next and then we can do uh Yeah, I guess we can like return back to where was it? The vault on Promethea. Time to go find Ava's room. Uh should be pretty much straightforward up here. On the right side. And we slide down, hey. 
Oh my, that's a lot of stuff. Hey, Eva. Um, I'm here to return all your goodies. There we go. Not sure why we had to place him specifically. <laughs> Thought I would just give you it and you would place him by yourself. All right. Thank you. How about this? You go enjoy those weapons and I go burn my dot. I mean, notebook, and we just never mention any of this again. Cool? Cool. All right. Uh, where's the weapons at? Um, another one here? What is this? Mysterial murder on Eschaden Row? That's a, like a podcast. <laughs> Wait. Malawan is the worst. Oh yeah, I know that. Except for Hyperion, Dahl, and even Atlas back in the day, I guess. Maya's <laughs> corporations are like bandits, but legal. That's enough to keep you up at night. <laughs> I mean, Handsome Jack, man, he really did a pretty big number on us. Um, okay, so is that really it? We didn't really get a new weapon, right? No, yeah, I'm not sure, but you know, it's fine, because, you know, I got some better ones <laughs> in here. Um, okay. Let's go accept this, I guess. Help me solve a ghost crime. Oh. Okay, good start. What's the rest? Okay. So, I've been thinking about how I don't really have any friends besides Hermes, and how I need to learn to open up to people. So, I'm starting a podcast. It's about <laughs> inexplicable crimes that were definitely committed by ghosts. It's called Mysteriously Earth. Mysteriously, or okay. That's a mouthful, and I say that as someone with a seventeen-syllable name. Hey, you try coming up with a podcast name that hasn't been taken. Anyway, I found a case on Promethea, and we're gonna solve it together as co-hosts. Go meet Lorelai in Escaton Row. All right, sounds good. I mean, we're going there anyway, so. Oh, so I believe to have found where that thing Marcus was with the quest. I mean, this is over here, right? Like below us should be. Uh, Marcus, right? You go over here. You over here is Marcus, and I've always wondered, like, what's, <laughs> like, what is? How do you, how do you get that quest? And yeah, it's actually in this room. I just saw it now. Um, yeah, let me go interact with it just to make sure it's not something that. Let's see. Oh, this is the uh, DLC. Okay. We're not going to be starting that. <laughs> okay, yeah, just uh, want to mention that because, yeah, I wasn't sure if I need to do, needed to do it, but yeah, definitely uh, don't need to right now. We haven't been customizing our character as well, right? Yeah, <laughs> got a Marcus bobble. Ooh, some other stuff here too. But yeah, we're gonna keep the, I'm gonna guess the default look for the most part. Ooh, jungle jams. I actually like that color scheme. Oh yeah. <laughs> then we got some colors. Echo theme, respecking. Even emotes. Wow, we even have like emotes in this game. Um No yeah, we'll just keep with the with that look. I just like the colors. Alright, let's go. It's Vault oh, boy. baby. Meet me at um launch pad. So Malawan has that laser on lockdown. There's no way your drop pod would get through security. But I've got a state-of-the-art Atlas brand ship with Gloking. So the plan is to fly up to the orbital platform and take out that laser before Katagawa knows what hit him. Um, okay, but I'm gonna have to delay on that main quest first. We gotta do a podcast with uh, Ava here. So that is what I'm going to do. I just realized I chose a vehicle that I don't want to use. But well, that's fine. Let's go to uh, this chat and row. Oh boy. Just crash into that. And yeah, this looks to be like a horror theme thing. So pretty much, you know, maybe a cool Halloween type stuff that's going to be going on over here. Ooh. Don't think we've been here before. Okay. 
And it looks like it'll be over there, right? <laughs> Look at this place. Oh, we're under attack. Uh, maybe I can just have some of my... Yeah. Use the bear here. Then just eject. Just to deal with some of these guys as I... Just move on. Yeah, go do your thing. Murderized. Nice. Dude, I love that iron bear. That auto bear. Oh, what is this? That's Chad and Roe. Okay. Ooh. Oh, yeah, this... This definitely looks like... A really horror-like thing that's gonna be... Taking place. Okay. Yeah, just in time for, like, Halloween. You know, that's going to be happening in a few days. Alright, here we go. Hello? Ooh, that... That mood, though. I like this. <laughs> Definitely the atmosphere, it's... It's really something. Alright. Wow, I feel like I'm playing a different oh, game. Over here. Today we'll be talking to Lorelei, a resistance <laughs> fighter on the side of Atlas in the Promethean War. With her cool hair and sweet jacket, she's like a quintuple shot of espresso. Strong and bitter. Yeah, I can hear that. You bloody kids and their bloody podcasts. Ugh. Bolt Anna, how did you get wrapped up in this? Sorry. <laughs> the way I see it, the more time Ava's occupied, the less she's in my room rifling through my stuff. Fair enough. Okay, well, come on then. Right, here's the situation. I had a top man undercover in a Malawan sleeper cell here in the row. I say had, because we just found him dead in his flat. Ooh. Malawan must have made him, but I've got to know how. There's been no chatter, and he was sure his cover was solid. Whoever killed him was someone he trusted. Ooh. Mm -hmm. And what of the paranormal aspects of the case? I told you, it's just a murder, nothing <laughs> paranormal. Perhaps. To the untrained eye. Ah, <sighs> crime scene's in here. Dude, look at this guy's gun. Yeah, the Crimson Lance. I guess they're just Atlas soldiers now, right? They're just soldiers? <laughs> We're not the Crimson Lance anymore. Alright, give it a look around. Oh. Um. What was that? Is that normal? I, I'm guessing it's normal. Oh, this must be the person that got destroyed. A lot of blood. Signs of a struggle. Looks like the murderer got more resistance than they expected. Remember when anyone in the six galaxies wasn't insane? Me neither. <laughs> okay. What about the food? Dinner for one. I wasn't expecting company. Okay. So it's pretty much still going solo. This reminds me. I need this month's siren's call. <laughs> Wait, who's that? What? Going commando? Is that Axon? <laughs> I like how that other cover, like that magazine just cover covers him up. <laughs> going commando. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, that's funny. Um, what's in this room? Anything paranormal? Oh. Cash and valuables are still here. This wasn't a smash and grab. Okay, so they weren't there for the money, I guess. Just to kill him? I have no idea. Uh, oh, something is sparkling over here. Nothing interesting here. There's a broken glass. I don't know, maybe... A uh, for Atlas. Hey, security! Oh! Can we look at the security cameras? Hmm. Door was locked from inside, no forced entry. Must have come in another way. Or they were let in. Right, what have you got? Okay. I mean, yeah, there's no security camera, so I'm not sure what I, what I was going on about. <laughs> that was just a lock for the door. <laughs> Um, hey Lorelai, uh, let's see what we can uh, conclude about this whole whole thing. Guy was ambushed in his own home without tripping the security system. Valuables untouched. The murderer only had eyes for him. Classic ghost scenario. 
pass right through walls, do a murder, go right back out the wall. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> or it was a person who was alive and he went out that window in the back. Oh, yeah. Well, maybe there's a clue out there. Check out that back alley. Find out if anyone saw anything. Okay. I mean, it makes sense. Looking at the map, <laughs> this is the only way forward, so. Oh, my. All right. There we go. Oh, hey, Lorelai. Not sure why you decided to drop in. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, she did. Oh, is that a class mod? Oh, okay. Nah. Don't want that. Uh, what's over here? Just some random... Get some random stuff. Oh wait, she's following me. Okay, I thought she was gonna stay, ba stay back. Okay. Uh, hey there. You saw someone climb through that window. You catch anything suspicious around here recently? Anything murdery? Yeah, I heard some noises. It sounded like a commotion or a din. Definitely a ruckus. Then, chanting? I heard them run out that way. Did you hear that? There was chanting! This is a supernatural murder for sure. <laughs> no, maybe the guy was just gloating that, you know, he did a murder or something like he accomplished something. Hey. You see anyone murdery come through here? Like either on their way to a murder or coming from a murder? I saw someone running that way. They were covered in blood. Oh. Hard to tell in all that red armor, but I know <laughs> blood when I... Red armor. There's crimson, and then there's scarlet, and I haven't even gotten to taste yet. It's an atlas. Man, this witness is so creepy we could get a whole segment out of him. But that red armor sounds like an atlas soldier. Yeah, it does sound like an atlas soldier. Get on your Nelly! There's no way one of our own would kill him. Maybe they stole his uniform. We were on to something, Vault Hunter. Follow that clue. Try to keep up. Oh, this shotgun is awesome. But yeah, very interesting. An Atlas soldier. Oh my. Thanks for letting me know, Lorelai. <laughs> a very interesting mission. That's an Atlas backpack, all right. Oh, damn it! But it just might have the lead we're looking for. Grab it. Okay. Give it here. Here you go. Atlas kit is all connected to a tracking system around the city. I can use the serial number on this pack to find the position of the armor and hopefully the murderer. Ooh. A breakthrough in the case. But can science stand up to the supernatural forces rising to thwart justice? This area is teeming with COV. One has to wonder how our ghost murderer got through. Perhaps they made a deal with the devil. All right. Oh, here we go. Be right there. We got a fanatic. Okay, hold on. All right, eject. All right, here we go. We're going in. Oh boy, slugger. All right. Going off. Nice. Then yeah, we can just use it again. Oh, it's a Goliath. Wow, we haven't seen that yet. I want to try to shoot his head off. If possible. Oh, Nobi's down. That was it. <laughs> okay, I'm getting off. Oh, that's sad. Yet, I remember just, I would love just shooting the Glide's head off. I thought maybe we can do it with our Iron Bear, but it doesn't look like we were able to. I mean, if there's another Goliath, I would like that. Ooh, Festering Goliath. There we go. Ooh. Wait, hold on. This is what I want to see. Let's go for it, bro. Oh, boy. 
Oh, is that it? Okay, get off. Alright, we're going in. Oh, fight! Oh, that was it. Well, that was kind of sad. Dude, we need to find like a bigger area or a lot of enemies to make more use of that Goliath. Hyperion Beasts. Oh, hold on. The thing is, my inventory is full, so I gotta drop some stuff. Uh, level 5. Oh yeah, we can drop. Uh, Q to drop. That's a... Uh, unique. Do I want to keep the uniques? I actually don't even know. Anyways, I'll go pick this up. Then consume it. There we go. Alright. Oh boy. Here we go again. Oh my. Okay. Alright. Hold on. Uh, I need to place and eject. There we go. Alright, go for it, buddy. And he's down. Oh, they just jump into the toxic waste. Okay, funny. Ooh, what is this? Why is the search area so big? I see that on the mini map. Dang, that's huge. Okay. Going out. Oh, Slugger's going in. Ooh, yep. He got us there. Ooh, youch. Going to eject. Oh, it's another Goliath. That's fine. Nice. Gotta go clear the slums. Ooh, guy up there. Oh yeah, there's a lot of baddies. Lorelai, are you still around? Where'd she go? Youch. Ooh, youch. There we got him. Yikes. Got him. Alright, we cleared it. Can't bloody wait for these wankers to get off my planet. Oh, come on, this way. Yeah, where were you? Another Atlas soldier kill my lieutenant. It doesn't add up. Or I'm telling you, ghosts. Not ghosts. You know, with the way the story is going, I feel like it could be a ghost. <laughs> Just for, you know, Borderlands humor. Like, I wouldn't be surprised. Okay. So what's next? It's gonna be a big, long hallway here. Ooh, big brawl out. Also. Uh, hold on. There we go. So I think now we can just focus on the guns over here. Go. Nice. 
Oh, is that my gun just floating up there? I just saw my gun. Yeah. Gun's floating. It is floating. Oh, youch. Get back to back. Oh, they're so far away. Oh, this guy's moving up. There we go. Goliath. Oh, there's a guy we can't get. Gonna have to walk up. Nice. Let me go ahead and collect some more ammo. I'm using more of my gun now compared to before. And yeah, I don't think I can ever. I don't think I can ever uh, get myself a new gun because these legendaries really do roll in. Okay, eject. Goliath is going angry. Oh boy, I'm going out. Ouch. All right, let me go and actually use it. Ooh. All right, nice. All right, we good. Yeah, a lot of enemies, just a wave after a wave of them. Like, it doesn't even feel that we're getting closer to, like, whatever truth they're supposed to be in here. Sumo? No oh boy. It's gonna go Goliath. Oh yeah, there we go. There we go, he's gonna fight all the other guys. I kind of just want to wait for a bit. Just keep on leveling him up. And the thing with the Goliath, at least from like what I remember, is that... You know, the dude levels up every time he kills someone. Including like his own guys. So uh, what is he gonna do? Alright. I might need to start getting out there. Go. And he's gonna go down soon. Now he's a mega raging sumo. Yeah, lower lies down. Ooh, yes. That is what I wanted. Bunch of loot went down, but nothing. There's no like. There's no legendary. But that's fine. Get a, get a torque weapon. Okay, aim was a bit bad. <laughs> but yeah, we finished it through. Ooh, that was kind of fun with the, with the sumo guy. Yeah, I really like that. But yeah, this area, man, really, really long. Oh, shoot. That, will the ghost murderer reveal their supernatural powers? 
<laughs> Just imagine. Hey! Oh my gosh! Will they get turned into spaghetti sauce by a subway car? Bollocks! Over here, Vault Hunter. Yeah, too bad. I'm sorry. Case closed, I guess? Dead murderer's better than a free one, right? Ah, it's all right. I suppose if we can't put the killer behind bars, we can at least put him in a bucket. Or five. Put the chanting! All the symbols! Yeah, I'll leave that for your podcast to work out. Good work, Vault Hunter. See you out on the streets. Justice brings a glimmer of light to Eschaton Row. <laughs> but where the light shines, the shadows only grow deeper. What's hiding in those shadows? All we know is, it just keeps getting mysteriously -er. <laughs> See you next episode, listeners. Okay, well, wow, was that really it? Yeah, I thought about it now. I think this is one of the... Ooh. New grenade. Gonna go use that. Yeah, I think this is one of the, um, one of the new, I think, from the designer's cut or director's cut. Yeah, one of those. Because, yeah, this is a very different mission, like a very different side mission, even with its own dedicated area. Also, why does this have null? What is unstable null? <laughs> I'm just going to take it because... I don't know, it just sounds interesting to me. Um, anyway. Uh, yeah. I guess now, uh... With that done, I guess... Launchpad 7? Unless I have some other quests. How do I see my quest over here? Yeah, we got some side missions. Uh, Electra City. I don't even know where that is. But yeah, how do I... What do I do for this one? <laughs> Go to Electro City. Is it going to be on a map if I like zoom out? Uh, let me see. I mean, yeah, we can do that first before we can do the main quest. Oh, it's in the Meridian Metroplex. Okay. Yeah, we can go there. All right, so I'm going to try to follow whatever this Electro City is. Oh boy, um, I am just crashing. Uh, maybe I need to look at the map first so I know where to drive. Oh, over here. Um, it's pretty much near where I, where I was. There we go. Yeah, Electro City is like right over there. But I am not sure how to... We got another uh, mission over here. Another side. Let's take care of this guy. And bam. Uh, let's see what this is all about. Hello? Um, technical no gout. Okay. Vault Hunter, there's this Quinn bloke, scientist, owes us some fancy nerd tech, but we haven't heard from him in a while. Go make sure he's not dead, alright? Oh. And either way, try to get me the Digistruct plans for this Nog hacking thing he's been working on. It would really help us out if we could turn those little bastards to our side. Yeah, okay. Um, though I do, uh, don't have a vehicle. Might take me a bit. So we are back here in the outskirts. This is pretty much the area where we were first were. Um, we just need to go head over there and then, yeah, we'll be good. Though it's gonna be, a uh, Ooh, probably be, be better if I get myself a vehicle. But also we can just go, like, walk all the way over there. Uh, yeah, how is the people here? Like, are they, are they still around? Or did they all, like, leave and evacuate? Oh yeah, they definitely ditched this place. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Um, I thought they would still be here at least. Oh wait, hold on. 
You got- oh, okay. They're just on this side of the uh, area. But I didn't see any Atlas soldiers, so... I'm not sure if they're still protecting this area. Are they? Oh, yep. They're just over here. Okay, I think uh, we should spawn in a vehicle. Get on over here. Uh, where do we go from here, though? Uh, you think in here? Let me check the map again. Um, yes, okay. I'm gonna go leave my vehicle there. Let's go check on Quinn. Okay. Oh boy. Got some more Molly Wan guys. Yeah, hold on, hold on. Gonna eject from here. Alright. Uh, looks like one more guy. Oh, got some more over here. Hello? Is that it? Welcome to <laughs> Iron Bear tried to go try to go for it. Ooh. Nice. Okay, locate Quinn. Aptly named. Hey man. Go away, you Malawan bastard! I am perfectly happy sitting in this closet forever with the rat species. And whatever that is. <laughs> hey, Quinn. Lorelai sent me to make sure you weren't dead. Lorelai. Oh yes, uh, the Atlas lady with the, with the guns and the hair. Okay, I'm coming out. Yo. Yes, yes. I I promised Lorelai an incredible weapon that only I, a verifiable genius, could create. A nog hacking grenade. <laughs> That's why Malawan's after me. Oh, okay. Now, this way, please. I will follow you. Make sure you're guarded. Are you gonna go? Yeah! <laughs> Hello? Am I just blocking your way, maybe? Okay, now we can go. <laughs> Let me guess, I gotta defend just need you. to run a few more tests on my Nog subjects, and the Nog hacking grenade will be ready to go. Yep. What? Where are my nogs? Oh, they, they must have escaped during the fight. Uh, uh, if I'm going to finish this weapon, I'll need them back. Okay. Luckily, I have a backup plan. <laughs> but I'll need your help. I'm digestructing a unique vehicle nearby. Go get it. Ooh, unique. Okay. Drive the nog catcher. All right. Oh, here it is. Oh wow. Nice uh, paint scheme. The vehicle is equipped with special uh science barrels, which will send my escape nogs back to me through complicated digistruct technology. Technology which I don't have time to explain to you. Oh, there's a nog. That's Ooh. one test nog. A good start. Nice. Alright. We got this. Another one. Two down, one to go. Yeah, easy peasy. Oh, I see it. I see one. Yeah, got him. That's all of them. I will now hack into their suits and add some special upgrades of my own design to create my fighting Nagadors. I'll be waiting for you at my console whenever you're ready. Oh yeah. I got you, man. So I wonder what's going to be very special. Let oh. me explain how Nogs work. You see, their helmets project an augmented reality game over the real world. <laughs> so these brainwashed idiots actually think they're playing a video game. <laughs> we can hijack the game system to show their allies as enemies. Oh, wow. Okay. Very interesting. Hey, Quinn. All I have to do is reprogram the Nog's enemy identification protocols, causing them to target Malawan instead of us. 
Now, I'll just repair the non-delivery system. It's time to place your bets, my fans! Let's go! <laughs> Uh, about that, uh, listen, I, I certainly haven't been pit fighting reprogrammed knobs for the locals to bet on. <laughs> certainly not. Now, use the button there to call the first Nagador into the ring. Ooh, are we gonna see them fight? I call him El Fuego, a Nog enhanced with the power of fire. Everyone likes fire, right? Oh boy. Oh, that's not supposed to happen. The special upgrade must have malfunctioned. But it's okay. We've got two more. Call in the next one. Okay. This one I'll call the conductor. Powerful as a raging lightning storm. <laughs> Alright, electric, and he's getting fried, dude. Okay, now call the last one. Let me guess, like the other elements. It's gonna be green, yeah, green. <laughs> I shall call him Nagador Maximo. Be here, hoping we don't lose this one too. <laughs> Checking systems. <laughs> the hacking worked perfectly this time. The knob will now target his own allies. <laughs> Oh, what's that? And just in time, too. That's the proximity alarm. Malawan is coming after me again. Hold them off while I send the weapon plans to Lorelei. Oh, boy. Okay. Lorelei, I'm sending you the Digistruct blueprints now. Quinn, good to hear from you. I see the data coming in. All right. Transfer in progress. Hold them off. I got you, man. Oh man, that's a lot of robots. That's what I do. Oh, is that him? Is that his nog going in? He's got a skateboard? Oh shoot. Okay. Yeah, that's very fun. Alright, there's a guy over here. And there's like one more on the outside. Oh boy, okay. Amber lamps. What? Whoa, 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 whoa. You give away a lot of money. The data is uploading quite slowly. Keep fighting. Oh yeah, hold on, wow. That was unique. Um yeah, I need to go head back. Uh, Quinn, careful. I kind of left you behind. Oh yeah, look at him go! <laughs> Alright, let me go. Use it up here. Alright, let's do this. There we go. I mean, the dropships, they got their own turrets. Oh boy. Alright. Ooh. Big boy. Big dude. Quinn is just standing there. He is not afraid that there's a badass right behind him. Transfer is complete. Lorelei, the blueprints for the nog hacking grenade are all yours. Got it. Thanks, Quinn. We owe you one. Yeah. Yes, you do. <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, you really do owe him. Please take one of these grenade mods as my way of saying it. You know. Thanks for keeping me alive. Will hack any knob so they become your temporary Nagador ally. Ooh, yes, please. Wow, what a 
appear our business is concluded and uh, my verifiable genius status is beyond question. As for me, I'll be continuing my Nog reprogramming efforts. The locals <laughs> need something to bet on, after all. <laughs> uh, I, I mean, uh, for the war effort and, and whatnot. Yes. Please leave now! <laughs> I will. Okay, wow. So we can try to control a Nog. Just one of these guys. Okay. But, like, the thing is, how much, like, you think we'll be able to... Ooh, a Nog mask. You think we'll be able to find them a lot? Nog potion number nine. <laughs> Converts Nogs to fight for you for 12 seconds. Yeah, I don't know how useful this will be. It just really depends on if we're able to find them a lot. But uh, yeah, I think for the most part, that's going to be it for this episode. We did, did a really cool like murder mystery thing. I think that was the main highlight <laughs> for this video. And then, uh, yeah, I kind of despawned my, uh, my, my cyclone there. Which makes me go a bit slower, but, you know, this vehicle is also kind of cool too. Oh yeah, this one's really cool with the, uh, electric, like, barrel thing. But yeah, next time I guess we'll go help out Reese since there really doesn't seem to be anything else to do. Uh, but yeah, that is it for now, guys. That's game.